Here we go. Alright, so this game's called Paratopic, and it wears its influences on its sleeve. It's got some cool fucking music. I was digging this earlier when I was changing the settings. No, the world has gone away for good. All right, Trent Reznor. All right. Sorry, Ronald Zertner. Every in every instance of somewhat electronic music with a slightly darker tone, I immediately go to Ronald Zertner. I I can't help it. Ron Zertner is Trent Reznor backwards, by the way. Let's go ahead and reveal that plot twist from a couple years. Like, wow, it's almost a year ago now, I think. You have an enemy, friendo. Not your friendo, buddy. We got a call about you. Undeclared goods, they said. I don't know what you're talking about. Then why did a concerned citizen feel the need to warn us about you? Yeah, well that ain't gonna work for you, bucko. There are procedures to follow. It's a crime not to. We're pretty full up. Busy night and all. No cameras out here. You think your lawyer's gonna stop me from checking out these tapes? What, home movies? No one will ever care if I watch them. You really shouldn't. It's funny that what the fuck there wasn't supposed to be music at that point I had two instances of the game loaded Jeff, was that supposed to happen like that? Like, was that dude supposed to see the tapes and then it was supposed to go directly into the intro credits? Or did I miss a scene? Sorry, chat. We're experiencing some slight technical difficulties. We'll go through very, very quickly. Uh, I'll make sure the options just... Just fly by. We're gonna see the dude watch the tape and then not skip the cutscene. That's a shame. You were responding to me about the two instances. <laughs> They're just tapes, man. Okay, alright. Cause I tabbed out and then I tabbed back in and then it skipped the scene. So we might have missed something, or maybe it really was just that short. It just didn't didn't make any sense. Wow, that was the cutscene. What the fuck? Bo Chaotica? Yeah. 
Well, this is truly a Sunday stream. Some scoots in there. It's like something's trying to say words, but it they kind of can't. Kind of cool. He's if you will follow these instructions, you will not deviate. You saw what happened last time, you will be professional. Well, this dude's face. There's like one frame of. <laughs> <laughs> Professionalism, just what I like to hear of, of course. A professional response. You won't be picking up the tapes here. We've left them in your apartment. We have a key. Should have told us, though. About what? You don't need to play stupid with me. Yes, not a good luck. We knew, of course, but we expected you to be professional with us. You must be completely open. Do you know another word? That's not professional. They're like dogs. Sometimes you have to throw them some scraps. Uh, we've given you some scraps to share. Cross the border and deliver the goods to the regular places. Whatever you do, don't watch them. Well, no, if you do. There's some, like, crispy critters sitting at the bar. Tortoises, Leon? Same thing. Sorry, turtle. Something tells me we've reached the height of understanding what's happening. And it's only gonna get worse from here on out. Like I said. I love the visuals, though. I really love this, like, pseudo-PS1 thing. When does the sex cult happen? Uh, probably about halfway through. Some men were here earlier, got into your apartment, didn't recognize them. Just the exterminators. Oh, that's a first. Bullshit! Management ain't authorized us for that. I got permission. You must think I'm stupid. It's tapes, isn't it? 
You need something? Need another one? I shouldn't. When has that ever stopped you? I I didn't know. <laughs> you don't know shit. I'm not supposed to. You've always been a good time. Or you whoa, 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 whoa! You've always been good to me before. Come on, I'm starving. Reckon you don't want nobody hearing about your friends. Can't you watch the one I copied last time? Used it up. Just static now. Got a whole lot there now. Just one tape. I won't say anything. I can't. I was gonna miss just one. Don't be an idiot. They found out last time. You still owe me. Nope. I will. Jesus Christ. Oh. Say so you're persistent. But I would not let her have the tape because I am to be professional. Yeah, it's well, it was Wall and Collar and Cal of uh, of Calhoun and a call to Goldberg Canning and a call to Wall Palmer. Call to Wall Calhoun. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it could come on me, how I keep your words, Gal Gal. This is what English sounds like to non-English native English speakers. It's Collar and Cal. So, I a call of Pinnipal, tell the Kubot Small, it a lot while a be so called Rian Gombe Karen. I think the VA is just trying to say nonsense words, but when he doesn't, it just the editor reversed the word. I am a rubbish driver. It's enough radio. So well, officer, I just had a couple drinks. Just a couple. <laughs> I'm just trying to crash so something will happen. Desert bus meet city car. Apparently, I missed something cool by not giving the woman the tape. I'm gonna need some beers. I like the hard cuts. It's kind of like a movie. Got any of that lowland milk? That's for the guy earlier that wanted to know what kind of milk I drank. Truck usually comes on Mondays. Oh, what's cheap? 
Yeah, we got 12 hour Spitfire, Beasley, Bub, Auntie M's old remedy. I'll go with Auntie M's. Auntie M's. She makes it over in Rio Laredo. <laughs> Family too. Cashier Putin. Kind of. It's totally safe. What's it taste like? It's got a lot of flavors. Strawberry, gooseberry, blackberry. Which one you want? Strawberry, please. Here you go. Anything else I could help you with? It's the nearest place to eat before the border. Nearest place to eat is... Uh, this latest burger bill is closer to the border. You got more places. Uh, what do you like? Let's do burger bills. Burger bills down 69th. You can't miss it. It's a big purple sign. Gave Frank a seizure one time. So it don't flash no more. On second thought... It's pizza. It's a cluster of fast food places near the place. Fears. If you want chicken. The joint if you're into pizza. The taco place if you want a place for tacos. What are you reading? It's a book by some guy named Eric. Uh, aliens are better than us. Aliens don't exist though. That's what you think. I've never seen an alien. It's because they don't want you to. So you were saying they're better than us? Yeah, just not technologically, but uh, also morally and spiritually as well. Morally. Consider this. Rich people really seem to like butting into other people's business, right? Like, it's not just tax-exempt cynicism. So they do more than donate to charity. Yeah, successful people think poor people are stupider. Or morally inferior in some way. They perceive their success as a moral success and the failure of others as a moral failing, which means that they feel they have the right to judge and in some cases shun people who are less fortunate than they are. So you're saying some people innately believe in karma. Yeah, more or less. Which means they believe in their success, earned or no, gives them the right to instruct others. Precisely. What does this have to do with aliens? Aliens are all one tribe. They don't think of themselves as better than anyone, and they don't try to make anyone's life worse than it already is when the person is clearly in pain. So, aliens possess empathy. And very hu few humans do. Uh, would that be everything? Whew, that was a hell of a thing. Uh, actually, I might be passing through late on my way back. Any place good to stay around here? Well, there's not much around here. Super 16 burned down a while ago. There's the Mesquite and the Ranchero. They're both down the highway a couple miles. Big signposts, ordinary chains, really. Nothing special. Super 16 burned down. Yeah. Bummer, that was my usual stop. So why'd you ask what was good around here? Thought I'd try something new. Guess you have to now. Oh, I hear that. Your friend feeling out there, up out there still, huh? Um, gonna just stay quiet. Guess I should mind my own business. What the? Right. Let's talk about aliens again. I like aliens. Did you know that aliens smoke weed? Yeah, that's how they got to where they are. Turn their skin totally gray. This was not the direction I expected this game to go in.
Wow, it's fucking Pokemon Snap now. I am so utterly lost. But whatever the narrative of these tapes is all about, I don't know. Don't really care, because I'm enjoying this. Pink bird is very elusive. I know I promised no more chirps on the stream. It seems like I've not kept my end of the bargain. Still didn't get the pink bird. I'm sure that's safe. Yeah, I love this this whole aesthetic. Really atmospheric. I, I also I like when a game goes a little bit low resolution. Like I always reference Burn Band, but that was one of the best walking simulators. I mean, it kind of just was perfect for me, the type of games I like, the type of aesthetic I like. But I also think that there is something to down resing a bit. It leaves more to the imagination. Anyway, I think I need just one more photo. Did you get your precious photos, Leon? There's also, um, an update to Burn Band, if not, like, a, just a full sequel or whatever they're doing with it happening kind of soon. There's a path to the right of the mill. Oh, I missed, okay. I vine blinded. I thought I had to 
take a picture of the pink bird. Bird. I would like to inform you all that there's nothing on the top but a bucket and a mop and an illustrated book about birds. See a lot up there? Don't be scared. Who needs action when you got words? Oh, good. I feel like this is the video game equivalent to the movie Drive. Especially this part. Specifically this part. Someone in chat wanted me to do a full Baldi stream. Dude, I don't I don't know how much more Baldi I can handle in my life, and I don't know how much more entertainment Baldi has. It's like a monster <laughs> laugh. Man, yeah, it's so cool. It's cool. So, now a call to Google Kid and a call. So we're all it's all go call and uh hey do got some of that. Go call right back. <laughs> right back. This music kind of reminds me a bit of a Clockwork Orange. Some, some long ass atmospheric driving sections. This, this game makes you wait. This is not for impatient people. I'm a little bit of both. I can be both patient and impatient. I feel like I want to give this game my patience. Because I'm just charmed by its looks. And like the wacky dialogue. But I know not everybody's gonna be into this. Someone in chat said, I'm kind of scared for no reason. What do you mean, no reason? This game has given you plenty of reason to be scared. I almost wonder if I'm actually two separate characters. Someone in chat says, this game seems to have a ton of different paths. And it's very different than when I played it. 
That's what they said. I'm beginning to think that the pink bird is just guiding me. And I'm not supposed to take pictures of the pink bird. And it's a red herring. Like, the whole photograph angle is just a red herring. It makes you want the elusive pink bird. But it's actually an alien. Or a spirit guide. Yep. That's exactly what that is. Second, please. Holy shit. Tapes are gone. Where are the tapes? Where am I- where am I going? Just driving to the end of the fucking virtual world like that movie. Whose name I always forget. Thirteenth floor, thank you, yeah. I always forget the name of that movie, but it, it's a good one. I maybe put a little... a little spice in the milk. 
there I maybe maybe put a little bit of ambience on top of the ambience. It fits a little bit too perfect. There's no exits, there's no turns. I don't, I don't want to actually influence the experience. We are truly on a road to nowhere, and no, I won't be playing that one. This reminds me of that time I came home from, I think it was PAX, a year ago, and I was listening to the last podcast on the left talk about number stations, and it was just getting like that kind of level of dark. And it was, it was a little, it was just a little frightening. But not just number stations, but a bunch of... A bunch of really fucking weird topics. Who are you traveling with? I'm on my own. Sure, right. You're not from around here. There is something out there. So you're not from around here. What makes you say that? Folks around here wouldn't need to ask about burgers. I haven't lived here in a long time. No kidding. Why'd you leave? Wanted to join the circus. Really? I wanted to be a clown. You? A funny guy? I didn't get the job. Not cut out for the circus? Afraid not? So what then? A little bit of this, a little bit of that. Very descriptive, I'm a poet. Are you really? No, that was a joke. Well, you aren't very funny. What's there to do around here? Would you be interested in a giant ball of twine? Uh, sure, I've been known to enjoy a giant ball of twine or two in my time. Well, it's not the world's largest ball of twine or anything. But they thought it was, uh, for a long time. Until they found out it wasn't. Plus, no one's sure how it got here. It just showed up one day. It just showed up. Yeah, it was about ten years ago. A big ball of twine showed up in the park downtown. In a big gazebo. Probably a prank or something, like I said, though. It wasn't just a big ball of twine. It wasn't. What do you mean? Well, they thought it was a big ball of twine, but someone found some yarn on it, too. So it's big. And it's also not 100% twine. It's heavier than it should be. No one knows why. So you said it just showed up? Why am I reiterating this information? What else you got? Well, there's the milk store, the state park, the ghost carnival, and the museum. Th the milk store. Yeah, it's a store, but they only sell milk. Milk products and milk accessories. <laughs> Tell me about milk accessories. Yeah, like milk bottles. Uh, you know, milk it comes out of mammals. The milk store is pretty much any kind of milk you could want. They own a farm out in the country, and they have all sorts of animals that make milk. 
And you can buy the milk at the milk store. That dude who asked me about milk earlier is so fucking happy right now. What's this ghost carnival? Yeah, we used to have this old carnival that would travel the state every summer and then winter just outside of town. No. Anyways, the lady who owned it got sick, so she had to set it up on her farm. Then she died, and everyone just kind of moved on. The kids say it's haunted. Oh, yeah, it's real neat. I don't know if you remember the electrical company, but there's lots of stuff people find in the woods sometimes. They bring it back, and they put it in the museum. It does weird stuff sometimes. Just weird stuff. You should check it out yourself. Right, time to get going. Yeah, it looks like your friend uh, has finished fueling up. Thanks. Anything else before you go? Well, no, but uh, you guys get much business these days? Being off the highway helps. When the electrical company shut down, that didn't help us none. Wasn't there some kind of accident? <laughs> yep. Must have been, what, 14 years ago now? But nobody really knows what went down. Nope. Well, I can't stay here forever. I better go. You two drive safe now. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Friendo? is even happening. Am I a tape? I either have to shoot... Fuck. I either have to... Um, shoot birds? Or shoot the thing that tried to kill me before? I'm also very good at going the wrong way. Goldenite jungle level vibe. I guess it kind of does. Was that 
in the woods past the old concrete meatworks. Yes, yes, that sounds right. It's hiking and there's just there's a body, it's all torn up. I think it was a girl. No, she's dead. She's a mess. She's just her tendrils were moving. We need to get someone out here. What? Oh, it's just getting good, too. So there's- there's multiple endings? I watched the tapes. People are saying because I watched the tapes. person you couldn't see gassing up your car killed you and reported the bo body. You got a bad ending, there's multiple endings, you weren't supposed to watch the tapes. Well, it's kind of, you know, it's kind of too late now, because the, the fucking driving segments take like 10 minutes. So I can't go and get another ending. So, can I get a YouTube link to the other endings, please? If anyone has them. I'm gonna look for them, too. But I am extremely, extremely intrigued. But also a bit confused. Um, I, I kind of... Let's see. I mean, I know the thing was played uh, out of order. Let's see. Question. I was hiking and there's this... There's a body. Same ending as mine. Um, there's a, a number of endings. For the longest, for the longest time. Wah. 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 Waluigi, Waluigi time. You said goodbye to me tonight. Wah. What else could I do? I'm so inspired by you That hasn't happened for the longest time I had second thoughts from the start I said to myself Hold on to your heart Now I know the woman that you are You're wonderful so far it's more than I hoped for. I so that's the best ending. How do you get that one? Do you have to not watch the tapes? Do you have to watch the tapes? Do you have to put the, the gun? Do I... Uh, 
Um, yeah. So, yeah, one of the there's there's like a kind of a bonus ending scene. You 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 talk to a dude, and then the, the dude you get to to join the circus as a clown. You know, people are just just linking me to what? pizza time. That's not the that's not an ending. Okay, well the immersion is totally gone now. Um, thank you for the Waluigi time. Uh, I don't think we're going to be able to find all the other endings. So maybe I'll just say, check it out for yourself. If you're interested, it was a cool game. And I, I kind of wish there was a little bit more, actually, because it was just getting good. Oh, I'm sure. Let's see. Some rando chat member. Definitely has the proper ending. Oh, yeah. Just, yep. All them YouTube clips. Okay. I can see where... Like, I can see that this is a losing battle. And that there will not, in fact, be any endings available for me to see. So, I want to thank you for watching. Yeah, that was, well, that was certainly interesting. I, I don't know what to do now. Okay. Um, cool game. The journey was, was cool. Um, could have been tightened up a bit, but I liked it. I think there's a lot to like.